local hometown favorite, Isaiah Ryder. Oh, between his legs. How about it? Charles Barkley, what do you think? Mmm. That's a good memory right here. Seems like the NBA don't want to give me my props, too, as far as the first one doing this. Ooh, it. There's, you know, Scottie Pippen, a raft, a few other people, the Gatorade sign, I think it was. So I had to move some furniture, had to move some things around to get my angle because I didn't want to miss it all. So I was thinking to myself, man, should I, <laughs> should I touch this? <laughs> I don't even think I said anything. I just kind of scooted that way. He gave me some space. And I looked over and seen me with Scotty, so I was like, ooh, you know what I mean? So then I just knew I'm going to give him something they never seen before. So after I did that dunk, I landed. And that right there, all the NBA pros were in the uh, at half court. So when I did that, there was some bets going on out there. <laughs> and Tumbo told me GP and a few others bet against me. I kind of, that was my celebration. And uh, in that circle right there, fellas, yeah, you now let them know I'm here. It was something new that people hadn't seen. So I think for a person to see it for the first time, they'd probably be like, you know, what did I just see? Let me rewind that. Let me run that back. Did not allow him to put it on the floor and get by. Oh, are you kidding? Play of the decade. Play of the decade. I tried that again a few times. Uh, I would hit the rim. I would hit the backboard. I would hit the backboard rim. Um, I never, I never made that shot again. Someone passed me the ball, gave me a bad pass, went out of bounds, threw it behind my back, all net, three-pointer. Would you believe it? Nah, you didn't do that, bro. Fundamental thing, always taught if the ball's going out of bounds, you gotta save it towards your basket. It was a lucky shot, but I was aiming, definitely throwing it towards the rim. I never saw the rim, I'm looking this way. I, I looked down here, make sure I didn't step out of bounds, grabbed it, but I knew where the rim was. Hey, that's the fundamental play. Anytime you lose a ball, you got to get it towards your basket, not the other team's basket. So I'm going to get it towards the basket. And wow, man, that thing went all mad. So ESPN ran it that night, and it was on. So I had people hitting me left and right. It was exciting, man. I got good publicity, good love for like a week. Man, one lucky play ended up being uh, goes down the memory books. Okay? A great accolade for me. Unbelievable. You got to see it. That's a play you got to see with your own eyes. Yeah, SB, play of the decade. Luck with a little bit of skill. Ryder working on Willie Anderson. Ryder on the left wing, dancing, juking. Dribble to the baseline. Anderson falls down. Ryder's left open. Jump shot. Good! Oh, can you believe the move by Ryder? Sorry to be you, young man. <laughs> I just had a laugh and giggle. That was my only response, man. Old school. Last play, last game of the season. Socks up. Wearing my own shoes. Shaved off my head and pulled my socks up for the last game of the season, got him on roller skates. So I saw him, his feet moving around a lot. He wasn't really decisive. You know, he was kind of guessing. Let me jab a few times. Let me get him going. Let me see where he's at. So, you know, it seemed like he was reluctant to guard me on that play, just honestly looking at his eyes. He, he didn't have that confident look. So I started moving real fast, move quick, fake right, went left. Down goes Frazier. <laughs> Oh man, that's cold right there. That's that footwork and them jab steps right there. He fell strictly off the jab steps. Man, when you see somebody fall, man, you can't do nothing but laugh and giggle. So I'm laughing and giggling at the man, right? Because he had that real serious look, moving his feet, uh, trying to <laughs> dictate which way I'm going to go or figure out which way I'm going to go. So, you know, once I got my space, and I looked, I seen him fall, and he slid on his backside and just was looking at me. So I'm just looking at him like, man, if you don't get up, 